MTL Trust Holdings was an English bus, coach and train operator based in Liverpool. MTL was originally the operating company of the Merseyside Passenger Transport Executive. To comply with the Transport Act 1985, this was divested into a new independent company, Merseyside Transport Limited MTL. Mersey Travel retained a shareholding, but this was purchased by MTL in 1993. On 17 February 2000, MTL was purchased by Arriva. Topic railway operations MTL was awarded two railway franchises in 1997, during the privatisation of British Rail. Both franchises were taken over by Arriva in 2000. Northern Spirit was a large franchise operating services across the whole of Yorkshire, including the Settle and Carlisle Line and much of the North East. The franchise also included Transpennine Express trains from Liverpool and Blackpool to Scarborough, Hull and Newcastle. The franchise was rebranded as Arriva Trains Northern in April 2001. Merseyrail Electrics was responsible for running the Merseyrail network in Merseyside. All services were subsidized by Merseytravel. The franchise was rebranded as Arriva Trains Merseyside in April 2001. Topic: <laughs> Bus Operations. The original bus division, Mersey Bus, introduced several new brand names, many outside of Merseyside, expanding into Manchester, North London, Lancaster, Warrington and South Lancashire. The company also owned Sightseers, a coach holiday business and had a full ABTA travel agency, The Travel Shop, in Williamson Square, Liverpool and in East Bank Street, Southport. MTL services employed many cleaning, maintenance and security staff in London and on Merseyside whilst MTL Engineering refurbished many hundreds of vehicles at the Edge Lane plant in Liverpool. The company subsequently expanded by acquiring local Merseyside bus operators Fairway Passenger Services of Kirby and Liverbus of Highton which by this time had grown to about 50 buses each. Subsequently, it purchased Blue Triangle of Bootle. Topic Merseybus The principal branding for the former Merseyside Transport private bus operation from 26 October 1986, Merseybus encompassed the following depots and divisions, Liverpool North Division, Gilmos, Green Lane and Walton Carisbrick Road, also known as Spello Lane Liverpool South Division, Edge Lane, Garston Speak Road and Speak Shore Road, also known as Woodend Avenue St Helens Division, Jackson, Shore Street. Southport Division, Canning Road Wirral Division, Birkenhead, Laird Street Liverpool's Prince Alfred Road Penny Lane, Litherland and Wallace's Seaview Road depots were not transferred to Merseybus and remained with Merseyside Private, ultimately being sold for redevelopment. Prior to this Merseyside Private used these depots to store non -standard vehicles Merseybus did not take on. These included a batch of five relatively modern wheelobrick bodied Dennis Dominators that had been based at the Speak Depot. Four were purchased by Maidstone and District, the other by Citybus of Hong Kong. Other notable types not operated by the privatised Merseybus included the East Lanx bodied Bristol VRs, many of which ended up with Merseybus's first notable competitor, Fairway Passenger Services, Scania Metropolitans and some life-expired Leyland Atlanteans and Nationals. However a significant proportion of the vehicles taken on by Merseybus were considerably older than these vehicles and included some of the K and most of the L registration Alexander bodied Leyland Atlanteans dating from 1971 to 73 and the increasing age profile of the Merseybus, MTL fleet, including the companies MTL would eventually acquire, would become a major issue for Merseybus, MTL right up to its acquisition by Arriva in 2000. At the end of 1992, the Merseybus parent company Merseyside Transport Limited was being prepared for sale by Merseyside PTA. Prior to this Merseyrider had been formed to operate Mersey travel contracts and compete with other operators at a lower cost structure, payscales in particular, than those within Merseybus. 
At the beginning of 1993 Merseybus was sold to its management and employees in an employee share ownership plan and in turn Merseyside Transport became MTL Trust Holdings and quickly began refocusing the Merseybus operation. Prior to the formation of MTL, the Merseybus fleet had aged significantly with the oldest Atlanteans, the mainstays of Merseybus fleet, now approaching 20 years of age or more. MTL therefore made a major effort to update the fleet throughout the 1990s in the form of a deal with London buses to purchase approximately 250 mid-life Leyland Titans dating from 1978 to 1984 between 1992 and 1994. 11 new Optare Metro riders from 1993 to 1995. 12 new Neoplan N4016 integral low-floor single-deckers in 1994 These vehicles were initially owned by Mersey Travel and operated by Merseybus on smart services in Liverpool 3 new Alexander Strider bodied Volvo B10Bs in 1994 120 new Wright Endurance bodied Volvo B10Bs from 1994 to 1996 36 new long wheelbase Northern Counties Palatine II bodied Volvo Olympians in 1995 96, mainly for use on cross river services between Liverpool and Wirral. 38 new Plaxton Pointer bodied Dennis Dart SLFs from 1995 to 1998. 20 new Wright Access Ultralow bodied Scania L113s in 1996. 22 new Northern Counties Palatine II bodied Volvo Olympians in 1998 for operations based at Gilmos Depot in North Liverpool and branded the Millennium Fleet. Four new gas powered Plaxton Pointer bodied Dennis Super Darts for use on park and ride services in Southport. 75 new Marshall Capital bodied Dennis Dart SLFs in 1999. Topic: Fairway Passenger Services Limited, MTL Fairway. Fairway Passenger Services was Merseyside's first major newcomer to bus operation in the post-deregulation period. It was established by four former Merseyside Transport bus drivers who remortgaged their homes and used the redundancy payments they received prior to the formation of Merseybus in 1986. Fairway commenced operations in January 1987 with a fleet of 15 to 20 X Merseyside Transport East Lanks bodied Bristol VRs on the F1 service between their depot at Hornhouse Lane on the Kirby Industrial Estate to Liverpool's Pier Head. Prior to the arrival of Fairway, Merseybus had significantly increased the fare scales previously used by Merseyside Transport and reduced withdrawn service levels on a number of routes across Merseyside. Fairway tapped into this by having fares significantly lower than Merseybus and plugging a gap with the F1 route along the popular Black Bull, County Road, Scotland Road corridor. This was very popular with bus users in North Liverpool and Kirby which at the time had high levels of unemployment and low levels of income and car ownership and the success of the F1 set the tone for Fairway's expansion. The F1 quickly gained 30-minute evening and Sunday operation and over the next 18 months Fairway expanded rapidly. 40 to 50 Northern Counties, Park Royal bodied Daimler fleet lines originally new to Greater Manchester Transport entered the fleet along with 10x London Transport fleet lines which came from Cumberland Motor Services as well as Fairway's first new vehicles, 10 Northern Counties bodied Leyland Olympians which arrived in 1988–89. Fairway's route network also expanded during this period and by the end 1989 Fairway had a core network seven high-frequency commercial services on the major bus corridors linking Kirby and North Liverpool to Liverpool city centre and a number of Mersey travel contracts. Merseybus was generally complacent to the competitive threat posed by Fairway and it took a while for it to respond. However, with its profitable routes under threat and passenger opinion becoming negative to Merseybus and more favourable to Fairway, it responded with a relaunch of its Kirby and North Liverpool service network in the spring of 1988 with similar fare levels to those of Fairway, new services which mirrored Fairways and increased frequencies. 
Northwestern also competed with Fairway on its F1 service using high-frequency minibuses with Fairsaver branding on a Monday to Saturday daytime from the summer of 1988. However Northwestern was unsuccessful and withdrew their F1 service by the autumn of 1989. Despite this competition, Fairway would successfully maintain its network of services in Kirby and North Liverpool for the next two to three years and modernised its fleet with newer ex Greater Manchester Northern Counties bodied Leyland Fleet Lines and four Northern Counties bodied Leyland Olympians new to London Buses Bexleybus Division in 1987, that were originally intended for GM buses. In addition, a coach excursion, private hire division was also established. However, by 1992 rumours began circulating that Fairway was in financial trouble and the once generally clean, well-maintained fleet was starting to look tried and dirty. With Merseybus now part of MTL Trust Holdings and engaged in a program of consolidation and expansion acquiring Fairway would naturally be of interest to MTL especially if Fairway was in financial difficulty and in the early spring of 1993, Fairway was acquired by MTL. Initially MTL kept Fairway as a separate entity from the core Merseybus division maintaining the Fairway route network and its yellow and blue livery. The only sign of MTL ownership of Fairway were stickers for the Supersaver season ticket that Merseybus had introduced in 1990, now also valid on Fairway services. Fairway was also a useful weapon for MTL to defend itself from GM buses North, South, who launched a network of commercial services in North Merseyside from September 1993 in retaliation to MTL's expansion in Greater Manchester with Lancashire Travel and MTL Manchester. However, by late 1993 Maltese Liras began to exert more influence over the Fairway operation. The ex Greater Manchester fleet lines had started to become time expired and were replaced with newer Metro Camel Wayman bodied Leyland fleet lines from Busways Travel Services, some Eastern Coach Works and Northern Counties bodied Leyland Olympians and Leyland Nationals from the main Merseybus fleet were also drafted into Fairway along with three brand new Plaxton Pointer bodied Volvo B6 for use on Mersey Travel contracts in Mersey Travel livery. In the summer of 1995, MTL's corporate livery of cream and crimson relief replaced Fairway's yellow and blue livery. This was initially introduced to a batch of 10 new Wright Endurance bodied Volvo B10Bs branded for the F3 service along with a new fleet name MTL Fairway. MTL further updated the MTL Fairway fleet with a batch of ex-London buses Leyland Titans from the main Merseybus fleet and second-hand MCW Metrobuses from Lancashire Travel. Despite this next few years would see MTL gradually close down the MTL Fairway operation with the Northern Counties Leyland Olympians that were new to Fairway and Merseybus being transferred to Liverbus in 1996 and by the spring of 1997, what remained of the MTL Fairway was transferred to Merseybus and operated by their Gilmos Depot. Topic Merseymade, Silver Service Merseymade and Silver Service were brand names for cross-river double-deck Merseybus services between Liverpool and the Wirral. Initially Willowbrook bodied Leyland Atlantean and five Alexander R-type Leyland Olympians which had been based at Liverpool's Green Lane Depot were refurbished at the Edge Lane Works with soft trim and coach seats in November 1992 and operated on Route 410 and 411 East Ham, Liverpool. At the end of 1995 this operation was augmented with a batch of 36 Northern Counties Palatine II bodied Volvo Olympians with similar features and used on the other Cross River services. Silver service branding was dropped inconspicuously during 1998. <laughs> Merseymini was a branding exercise for Merseybus's attempt at minibus operation. Merseymini used a fleet of Alexander and Northern Counties bodied Dodge S56s, including some bought second-hand from GM buses, and its most notable routes were two Merseytravel contracts and two commercial services. 
Other services between Highton, Old Swan and Belle Vale were quickly dropped and the Merseymini name quietly vanished around 1992, when the low-cost Merseyrider unit became more involved with minibus operation. <laughs> Merseyrider Merseyrider began life in the autumn of 1992 as a low-cost operation set up by Merseybus a few months prior to the sale to privatization. Merseyrider operated on lower margins and what would prove controversial pay rates than Merseybus and initially operated out of Liverline's former Blackstock Street depot near Liverpool city centre after Liverline had moved to a new depot in Bootle. Many of Merseybus's Mersey travel contracts were transferred to Merseyrider as well as Liverline's Commercial Service 102, Walton, Broadway, Broadgreen Hospital. At first, the fleet included Merseybus's remaining Willowbrick bodied Leyland Atlanteans and a number of hired minibuses, which were replaced at the beginning of 1993 by new K registration Marshall bodied Mercedes Benz 811Ds and a handful of similar G registration vehicles bodied by Carlisle and bought secondhand from Cambus. These vehicles were painted in a cream and green livery not dissimilar to the former Liverpool Corporation, Merseyside Transport Scheme. That same year MTL was keen to expand the Merseyrider operation on both marginal services and retain its position in Liverpool's hotly contested bus market. The operation was therefore transferred to the mothballed Shaw Road depot in Speak which Merseybus had vacated in 1989. A substantial number of Merseybus's East Lanks bodied Leyland Atlanteans were transferred to Merseyrider, appearing at first in a maroon and silver variant of Merseybus's maroon livery, then a rather more attractive silver and blue scheme until the adoption of MTL corporate cream and crimson livery at the beginning of 1994. Additionally, the operations of Blue Triangle were transferred to Merseyrider after MTL acquired that company in the spring of 1994, along with three Alexander Strider bodied Volvo B10Bs, which were part of MTL's intake of new vehicles from 1994 to 1996. Merseyrider, however, was creating conflict between MTL's management, who were keen to expand the operation further, and its employees and the unions, who were concerned about new drivers being on lower pay scales to those within the core Merseybus operation and a bonus scheme based on the takings of each individual driver, a major source of profitability for MTL's competitors. Unions finally called a series of strikes in 1994 and 1995 after the transfer of Service 72 Halewood, Liverpool City Centre from Merseybus's Garston Depot in South Liverpool to Merseyrider, with the effect that with the exception of MTL Fairway and ironically Merseyrider the entire MTL operation was off the road. MTL reconsidered its position and eventually brought the Merseyrider's terms and conditions in line with those of Merseybus, which compromised the profitability of the operation and subsequently it was closed. Some services were transferred to MTL Fairway and in August 1996 the Merseyrider operation ceased when MTL transferred the Garston depot of Merseybus to the Shore Road depot in Speak. Topic Lancashire travel Between 1988 and 1993 Merseybus began expanding the network of services operated by its St Helens depot. At first these were to nearby Wigan but gradually a network of Merseybus services began to appear in Bolton, Salford and Manchester. GM Buses was already under siege from a number of independent operators in Greater Manchester and the arrival of Merseybus, MTL in their established territory started a bus war between the two companies from 1993 until the summer of 1995. MTL launched a two-pronged attack on the Greater Manchester bus market. The first of which consisted of the creation of a new company, MTL Manchester, which had a depot in the Miles Platting area of Manchester and mainly focused on competing with GM buses north, south on city corridors in Manchester and satellite towns such as Altrincham, Bury, Sale and Stockport. The second phase of MTL's move into Greater Manchester was to rebrand the Merseybus services operated by the St Helens Depot as Lancashire Travel in the autumn of 1993. 
In turn Lancashire Travel expanded onto much of the GM Buses North network of both local and interurban services in Bolton, Wigan, Lee, Salford and North Manchester. To facilitate this the 1989 batch of 25 MCW Metrobus MKIIs were transferred from Merseybuses Gilmos Depot to St Helens along with some early model MKI Metrobuses, again from Gilmos and a variety of second-hand sources including London Buses, Mainline, Newport Transport and Yorkshire Rider. In addition MTL's first new vehicles, 13 Wright Endurance-bodied Volvo B10Bs, were delivered to Lancashire Travel in the spring of 1994. These moves provoked GM buses north, south, to begin new services in Liverpool, Southport and the Wirral, the latter using a light blue and cream livery, not dissimilar to that of Birkenhead Corporation, and were branded Birkenhead and District. However the moves by MTL and GM buses north, south into Greater Manchester and Merseyside were highly unprofitable and as such a controversial gentleman's agreement was signed between MTL and GM buses north, south in June 1995, which saw MTL pull out of much of Greater Manchester, with the exception of Wigan and Lee near to Lancashire Travels St Helens Depot and GM buses north, south from all of Merseyside, including its well-established 34 Liverpool, Manchester Manchester Express and 320 Liverpool, Wigan services which severed some important links between the two conurbations. This agreement was subject to a 1995–96 Monopolies and Mergers Commission study which found MTL, GM Buses North, South, North Western and other Merseyside bus operators in collusion and in breach of fair trade resulting in fines for all concerned. By that time GM Buses South had been acquired by Stagecoach and rebranded Stagecoach Manchester and GM Buses North by First Bus. MTL maintained the Lancashire Travel branding for the St Helens Depot however MTL North fleet names were used by St Helens from the spring of 1998 right up to the acquisition of MTL by Arriva in February 2000. Topic Southport and District Southport and District was a rebranding of Merseybus services in the Southport and Formby area, and was part of a general exercise to introduce local branding at MTL in 1994. Topic Wirral Peninsula Buses. Wirral Peninsula Buses was another of MTL's brand names, introduced in 1994 for services in the Wirral area. The Wirral Company was based at Laird Street, Birkenhead, Wirral and now the bus depot is owned by Arriva North West. <laughs> St Helens Rider St Helens Rider was an earlier branding exercise, introduced in the summer of 1993 for Merseybus services 33 and 44 in St Helens. These routes were facing large amounts of competition from a number of smaller operations in the town and the St Helens Rider operation was relatively short-lived, being quietly dropped around the time the Lancashire Travel branding was adopted by St Helens Depot in autumn of 1993. Topic: Blue Triangle. Based in Bootle, Blue Triangle was formed by a former Merseyside transport driver, David Forrest, in the late 1980s. Unlike Fairway, Liverbus, and Liverline, who built up substantial commercial operations competing with Merseybus, Blue Triangle initially focused upon Mersey travel contracts with a small fleet of second-hand vehicles. However, by 1992 Blue Triangle had begun commercial operations and by the spring of 1993 the fleet had increased to over 20 vehicles including an ex-London Green Line coaches Stretch Olympian, two new K registration Plaxton Pointer bodied Dennis Darts along with an assortment of Alexander Al bodied Leyland Atlanteans originating with Merseyside Transport and repatriated from the Isle of Man. MTL acquired the company in the spring of 1994. Excluding the Dennis Darts, Blue Triangle's fleet was sold and the operation transferred to Merseyriders Speak Depot. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Liverbus, MTL Liverbus. 
Originally owned by Jemsom Holdings, Liverbus was an independent operator set up by former Merseybus employees in January 1990. Initially founded with 30 to 40 XGM buses Northern Counties, Park Royal bodied Leyland Atlanteans, Liverbus built up a network of services between its Highton base and Liverpool city centre competing with Merseybus services from the Gilmos and Green Lane depots. A private hire, coach excursion operation, Coach 2000, was established in the summer of 1990, along with two more routes in the autumn of 1990, both of which bypassed Liverpool city centre, using a fleet of ex-London buses MCW Metroriders. Initially Merseybus, unlike the approach it adopted with Fairway and Liverline, did not oversaturate services competing with Liverbus. With the exception of two short-lived Merseybus services, the two operators appeared to co-exist. By 1993 Liverbus had invested in its first new vehicles, eight Northern Counties Paladin-bodied Volvo B10Bs and a Northern Counties Palatine II-bodied Volvo Olympian, and became involved in three long-term Mersey travel contracts and established a London operation, London Suburban Bus. Liverbus announced a significant order for new vehicles in the shape of a further four Northern Counties Paladin bodied Volvo B10Bs and two Northern Counties Palatine II bodied Volvo Olympians, which had already been delivered during 1994 95. MTL began competing with Liverbus in summer 1995, completely duplicating its entire network, and a few weeks later it was soon announced MTL had acquired Jemsom Holdings. Initially the Liverbus white, red and brown livery was maintained but the announced investment did not materialise and a significant number of ex-MTL Leyland Nationals were transferred to replace the ageing Atlanteans. In 1996 the MTL cream, crimson livery along with a new fleet name, MTL Liverbus, was adopted until the appearance of the MTL North fleet name in 1998. The heightened depot and route network was maintained until the acquisition of MTL by Arriva in 2000 who after a route revision in the spring of 2000 withdrew many of the former Liverbus routes. Arriva closed down Heighton Depot in June 2006 as it was too small and operations transferred to Green Lane Depot in Old Swan. <laughs> MTL London. On 26 October 1994, MTL purchased London Northern from London Regional Transport. In April 1996, MTL purchased London Suburban. In August 1998 both were sold to Metroline. Topic MTL Manchester The MTL Manchester operation started in the summer of 1993 somewhat controversially sparked a bus war with GM buses, and to a lesser extent North Western's B-Line operation and the Greater Manchester Independence. MTL Manchester eventually operated in most districts of Greater Manchester and the operation was rumoured to be in preparation for a bid for one of the North, South GM buses companies which had been owned by Greater Manchester Private and had been ordered to be sold and split by the government by 1994. In turn GM buses retaliated in the form of competition with MTL in Liverpool, Southport and the Wirral, using the Birkenhead and district branding in the town. Overall this competition was damaging to both MTL and GM buses North, South who ultimately were making losses and an even more controversial gentleman's agreement between MTL, GM buses North, South in June 1995. <laughs> <laughs> MTL North MTL North branding first appeared on Lanarkshire Travel, Merseybus, MTL Liverbus and MTL Village vehicles from the spring of 1998 and survived until MTL's acquisition by Arriva in February 2000. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Coach Operations. Topic: <laughs> Haysham Travel Haysham Travel was an independent coach operator that was operating commercial bus services in and around Haysham, Lancaster and Morecambe in North Lancashire. 
After privatization, MTL was keen to expand and one such opportunity was council-owned Lancaster City Transport LCT, which was facing stiff competition from Ribble Motor Services later Stagecoach Lancashire. As a possible lead up to taking over LCT, Haysham Travel was one of MTL's first acquisitions. However, worried about a possible takeover of LCT by MTL, Stagecoach Ribble registered duplicate services over the entire LCT network and by the early summer of 1993 had succeeded in driving LCT out of business and acquiring its asset base. Despite this, MTL retained the Haysham Travel operation, transferring in some Alexander R-type bodied MCW Metrobuses, as well as Alexander and East Lanks bodied Leyland Atlanteans from Merseybus and second-hand Leyland National 2s, ironically purchased from Stagecoach Ribble to replace Haysham Travel's aging coach fleet. Haysham Travel's green, yellow and white livery was also retained up until the late 1990s and this operation was retained by MTL. Being located at least 40 to 50 miles away from MTL's core operations on Merseyside, the fleet was managed at an arm's length and had few opportunities for expansion. After the acquisition of MTL by Arriva in 2000 the Haysham Travel operation was sold to Stagecoach Ribble in April of that year. MTL Village Village Group Tours was a long-established coach operator based in the Garston Village area of South Liverpool, from which the village name was derived. At first they were minor players in Merseyside's bus scene, only appearing on Mersey travel contacts with a handful of aging double-deckers. However around 1992 Village entered Liverpool's bus war on a large scale, beginning extensive Monday to Saturday daytime operations on two routes between Garston and Liverpool. These South Liverpool routes were popular with students and were already a hotbed of competition between Merseybus, Liverline, North Western, Merseyline and CMT buses. A new depot in Evans Road in Speak was used to house a fleet which by the end of 1997 had grown to around 60 vehicles, the majority of which were Leyland Titans that were proving popular with Merseybus, MTL and included some rare X Greater Manchester examples and B-15 prototype NHG 732P. Village was acquired by MTL in the spring of 1998 and despite Merseybus's Shore Road depot in Speak being yards away from Villages, MTL kept the Village depot and ex-London Leyland Titans which fitted in well with their own large fleet of the type. The operation was renamed MTL Village and used the MTL North fleet name from 1998 onwards. Furthermore, some ex-Merseyrider, Merseybus services were transferred to MTL Village. When MTL was acquired by Arriva the Evans Road garage was quickly vacated and many of the services rationalised when they revised the MTL service network in April 2000. <laughs> 